Welcome to Spot a Movie. Today we are going to review and analyze one of the best movies of 2022. We are talking about everything, everywhere, all at once. This video contains spoilers, so if you haven't watched the movie yet, consider to check our movie introduction to the film. You can find the link in the description. When a movie wins 8 awards in a couple of months from the day of its release, it means that we are talking about a sensational movie. And let's be honest, Everything Everywhere All At Once is a unique production, and it can easily target some Oscar in 2022. Then we may think that the film is perfect, right? Almost. And in this video we are going to tell you why. But we will tell you also what did we learn after watching the movie, what did we like and what we didn't like about the film. So what did we learn after watching Everything Everywhere All At Once? The director immediately shows us what we are going to experience through the entire film. In a mirror we can see them happy together, then an empty scene and finally we are introduced to our character with a beautiful camera movement. And let's talk about our character evolution. In fact all the characters experience an incredible character arc during the entire film. And they grow through the story, find inspiration in one particular element. Kindness. Kindness is the hidden superpower that transforms our character and us into a better person. It's a powerful message and let us explain to you what happened during the entire story. Let's start with Evelyn. When we first meet her, Evelyn is stressed and overwhelmed. She doesn't want to disappoint her father. Evelyn doesn't listen to her family. As we witness, Waymond and Joy are in Evelyn's thoughts. Waymon tries to ask for some time to talk about their possible divorce. Joy brings Becky with her to the party. But Evelyn ends up being not really kind to them. Evelyn is only focused on accomplishing her daily task. She doesn't have time for her family and her life. Evelyn suffers from the idea of being judged by other people. For example, when Joy tries to explain that Becky is her girlfriend to her grandpa, Evelyn stops her and tells him that Becky is just a friend. Evelyn can stand her father and therefore it's her family that pay the price. She does enjoy the frivolity of a silly dance between Waymon and their customer. Evelyn is not mentally there with them. But Evelyn also has several hobbies and qualities that she does enjoy because she lost the ability to love herself and her life. The laundry shop is her only focus and not even because she enjoyed it, but because it's a distraction from her failure in life, her family and frustration. How do we know that? When Alpha Waymond reach her and perform to her a mental scan, Evelyn revisits her past and we discover in a confusing and touching passage of memory the complex relationship she had with her father and the dreams of a happy family with Waymond and Joy. Evelyn leaves the drama to don't be grateful for what she has and still wonders what it could have been instead. And the drama becomes a tragedy when we discover what Evelyn is doing to her daughter Joy. She is bringing to her the same damages that her father brought to her and then created the dangerous job to Pikey. But what changes Evelyn and the story? We can say that Evelyn is a bad character. Yes, probably punching an IRF official wasn't the best choice of her life. We agree with you. Yes, probably not even saying to her daughter that she's getting fat was a good idea. Ok, you have a good point. Also destroying her shop wasn't a good idea, especially in front of the police. But Evelyn taught us something while jumping from a universe to another universe. First, Evelyn will never hurt or kill her joy. Even if she has to disappoint her father who was asking for it. There aren't threats or risks that can bring a mother to commit such a disparate act. And secondly, in one of the many universes, Evelyn is finally ready to admire the real quality and strength of her Waymond. Yes, we are talking about his incredible and unbreakable kindness. Waymond teaches Evelyn and us that we must stop fighting each other and instead be kind. Kindness is the real revolution. It's not an easy business, let's be clear. If we observe Waymond's life, we witness the heavy price he needs to pay to battle and keep kindness ongoing. He is always nice to Joy and Evelyn, 
Waymond never complains or gets upset with them. When Waymond brings the divorce letter to the table, he does it because he decided to free Evelyn from the prison of the shop and her family. He wanted Evelyn in and part of their dream that they share and made together. And his drama is touching, especially when at the IRS office he sees an old couple kissing each other with love. And he wonders why this is not the case in their relationship. But anyway, Waymond keeps going and doesn't give up. Incredibly, he gains another extension from the tax office, simply showing empathy and kindness. And those are universal words, therefore the IRS officer grants the extension to them. And it happens when Evelyn is instead thinking that their husband is making things worse. But finally Waymond succeeds and brings Evelyn into kindness and brings a new character. Waymond explained to us that we can be warriors by simply accepting and absorbing the sufferings of other people and doing our best to make a change and improve others. And let us tell you, this is a task that requires incredible strength and a good art. Therefore, Evelyn inspires, and during a moment of battle, she becomes a warrior who fights to bring together two people in need of love, fixing the health of another man, also slapping another one. Well, no one is perfect, right? But what matters is that Evelyn acts her fear and makes peace with them. She is a new woman now, who learns how to fight and deal with her anxieties. But Evelyn hugs and kisses finally her Waymond. Now she can truly love him. But Evelyn is not the only character that changes and turns into kindness. Let's look at Joy, for instance. She loves her mother, but she doesn't know how to communicate with her. Joy built a bagel as a solution to destroy herself and escape from any delusion, disappointment and everything. In the end, Joy is the younger version of Evelyn, struggling to express her love to her family and share with them her dreams of love and life. Fortunately, Evelyn understands the mistakes she is doing and rectifies her behavior. Are you ready to do the same? You can see by yourself how important is kindness. With our loved one, but also with our tax officer. It says a lot. Even Gong Gong changes thanks to kindness. If in the beginning he was judgmental and not certainly polite with his daughter, in the end he let her free to save joy. He accepts Becky in his life and play with her because love goes over the barriers of language. And fortunately, Evelyn does the same with Joy. She lets her daughter free to live her life with Becky. If kindness can convince a tax officer to grant you more time to save your shop, if it can save family dreams and our alpha version, then from today, kindness is what we should chase every day of our lives. For ourselves, for our loved one, but also for strangers. As you can see, everything, everywhere, all at once is not only a masterpiece of cinematography and photography and visual effect, but especially an incredible source of inspiration to drastically change our relationship with the people around us and ourselves. So be kind, especially when you don't know what's going on. And don't forget to love even more all the people that are fighting with their kindness to keep you with them absorbing your pain and challenges. Let's accept ourselves, our children, our loved ones, for what we are, without pretending to change them and offer them our time. In the end, kindness is a gift, not only for Joy who found Becky, or for Evelyn who find Waymond, but for each of us ready to embrace it. But before we move to our pros and cons about the film, we want to share with you another point of view about the movie. The multiverse, the different version of what we can be in different metaverse, look to us as the continuous struggle that we have with our unconscious and anxieties. It's always the fight for what we are and what we could be, like everything. While it's clear that we must accept ourselves for what we are. And the catharsis happens when they gain the extension that saved their laundry shop. Their business looks like another metaphor because now they can clean themselves from their struggles, differences and problems. Precisely like clothes, wet from a rain made of sufferance and dried from a warm wind of kindness. And finally everything happens during the Chinese New Year 
And what better moment to start a new commitment and goal for your life if not during a new year night? Genial choice from the Daniels. There is so much to say about the movie, but the time is running out and we need to move to our next section of the film, our pros and cons. So what did we like about the film? The Daniels deliver a masterpiece in its genre. It's a touching story after a lot of digesting and processing. The actor are sensational and the whole cast will target some Oscar in 2022. The music, the photography, the makeups, the costume, the special effect, everything is top notch everywhere we look. And it comes so beautifully all at once. Okay, after this one, we deserve an Oscar too. <laughs> we are joking, but the movie is undoubtedly well done and delivered. We got inspired by the story and surprised by how the Daniels found the space to deliver us some memory of Force Matrix and Ratatouille. But as we mentioned, the film is a masterpiece after a lot of processing and digesting. At this point, let's move to the cons of the movie. So what we didn't like about the film. If you have to suggest a relaxing movie to your friend to let them enjoy their movie night, now you have the opportunity to trick them and confuse their mind. Let's be honest, the film is mind-blowing and it requires some effort to be understood. Let's be clear, we love these kind of movies, but everything is too much, everywhere and all at once. For example, people with hypersensitivity may be stressed watching the movie. The story is overwhelming and confusing with all the jumps across multiple universes, but we must say that it's like the struggle we have daily with our mind. Is it ever relaxing or easy without it? The film is anyway a bit bizarre, surreal and complex, and we don't want to criticize the movie, but instead kindly ask you to take the time to watch and rewatch the movie, so that you can properly digest it. It is worth the time and the effort, as we have seen together. For this reason, our final rating for everything, everywhere, all at once is 9 out of 10. Let us know if you agree with our analysis and your opinion and vote about the movie in the comment section below. Spot a movie is the place where movie lovers can exchange their opinion about the film, so that we can appreciate the most about it. We hope you enjoy our analysis, if yes, like the video and share it with your friend. Drop a comment to let us know your opinion about the film and consider to subscribe to don't miss any of the new and best movie release on the major streaming platform. See you in the next video with a new movie.